Okay, parents, I need to know what you would have done in this situation. Yesterday, I took my five-year-old son and my four-year-old daughter to the chain Italian restaurant. You know which one I'm talking about. We got there early because we didn't want to be there during a rush time. And as soon as we walked up to the table, my son goes, mom, can I play games? Because they have those little like tabletop game things where you can like pay your bill, but also there's like games on it. And my daughter, who's four, automatically goes, oh, mom, I want to play too. And I say, hold on just a second, babe. We need to wait until we talk to our waiter to make sure that we can use one from another table. Mind you, it is not busy. We are not there during a rush time. There's like maybe 10 other families there. In our like little subsection, there is literally nobody else. Like it is just us. The hostess overhears and walks right back and says, oh my gosh, you can totally have this one from another table. The hostess walks over, grabs it from a different table and then hands it to my daughter and says, no problem. She says, now, mom, when you go to pay, you need to make sure you remember to use the one that your son's using. And I said, of course, thank you so much. I really appreciate that. As she's walking away, a waiter comes over and grabs it from my daughter and says, no, you can't have this. You can't have this. It goes on the other table. And my daughter starts getting upset. And I look at him and I say, actually, your hostess is the one that gave it to us. She said that this was okay. And he goes, I talked to her. I'll talk to her and like runs off. Turns out that that was not our waiter. He did come back over and say, you're right, it's fine, like no problem, no problem. And I said, okay, thank you. So then our new waiter is standing there during this time. We order our drinks and he brings them out. We've decided what we want for our lunch and I start to order what we want for lunch. While the waiter is standing there, my daughter accidentally clicked the pay my bill, but you have to just exit out of it and then go back to the games. But when she clicked it, it turned green to the top. And it made the waiter notice, oh, there's two of these here. And he goes, wait, you can't have that. And starts to grab it away from her. And I said, please don't talk to my daughter. <laughs> and he's like, you know, you're going to get charged for that. And I'm like, okay, they're, it's like $2.99 to play these games. That's fine. Like, I'll just pay $2.99 twice. Like, it's, fi it's fine. And he starts kind of like, he's like getting an attitude with me. And I'm like, do you need to get a manager? And he's like, I mean, yeah, I'll ask. And I was like, okay, well, let me know when you're ready to take my order. And then he goes, well, what do you want? The order or the manager? And then I was like, okay, I've had enough of the attitude. I'm like, why don't you go ahead and get the manager over here? So the manager comes over and I explain what happened. And she's like, yeah, no problem. Like she can have this. I can actually change it. So it's both of these are assigned to this table. So then you will not have to pay $2.99 one time. Like it's no problem. And I'm like, fantastic. Are we good then? No other man is going to come up and start talking to my daughter and start trying to take this thing away, telling her she can't have it because you guys are the ones that gave it to her in the first place. And she's like, no, it's no problem. Like, no problem. But I like felt this like level of guilt of like, I don't ever want to talk to a manager. I don't ever want to be a Karen. I still tipped that man 20% and was kind and cleaned up my plates and made sure we didn't leave a mess and was like kind the rest of the time. And I'm like, your staff gave it to her and told her it was okay. Then two people, two men who she doesn't know have come over and tried to take it away from her and tell her she's not allowed to have it. Meanwhile, they didn't even know if she could have it or not. And mind you, the last time that somebody tried to take it, she started crying because she was like scared because of how he like, what he said and like how he, he like took it away from her. And the manager was like, would you like a free dipping sauce? Like, no, I, I don't want a free dipping sauce. Like, I'm good. 